We've been in a great Christmas spirit all morning, and now I guess we're going to determine to end it. Yeah. We're getting into the debates <laughs> yeah. that people have yeah, 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 over yeah, yeah, Christmas it's all over Day. Now. Brought in Dan now. Abrams and Jane Bucking and the CEO. I'm the opposite of bringing in good cheer. Yeah. No. Yeah. Not with Jane, thank you for coming yeah. uh, thank as you well. For from that <laughs> nice introduction. <laughs> but we, we are. These are de debates that everybody does have. Everybody does think about. We're going to start out with uh, the one about how long we've seen all these over-the-top Christmas decorations everywhere. The big question is, how long do they stay up? I take mine down January 1st. I figure it's a great yeah. thing for cure. Yeah. Cool. You know, you're at home all day. Mm -hmm. My husband's home all day. Something <laughs> to do with him. And then, you know, you start the new year fresh. I like watching I like football it. all day on January 1st. Isn't that like a great football day? No, I like to I like to watch the decorations be taken down on <laughs> the New Year's Day. Yeah, I might have to kind of like that too. I like, them, I like seeing them early. I'm one of these people, all these people complain when they go up early. To me, it's sort of a good yeah, feel. Like, yeah, I like, I'm yeah. good with November. Day after Thanksgiving's great. You know, even early. Really, is that when they go up in your house? Not, we don't always make it better. <laughs> yeah. Can I tell you, yeah. in L.A., in a department store, on my birthday, which I know you know, September 18th. All right, so, okay. so going down, you somebody who says January 1st, I, I, I like, like a to, week later. I do too. I like to keep it up because I'm a little late mm -hmm. getting mine up, so yeah. I like to. A week have later, them up. they're falling off. You like that whole 12 oh. days of Christmas? I am yeah. yeah. all, all for that. It's just really depressing. Yeah. This, yeah. It feels like, it feels like the Santa would like the dirt in his beard. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's move on. <laughs> okay. What are the rules for re gifting? Ball goes up. Oh, yeah. Uh, I, I think regifting is great. I'd like some disclosure, though. I think if you're going to regift, be honest. Be honest about it, and say, you know what? Oh. By the way, I got this as a gift um, because no, look, I get look, Robin's <laughs> no, 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 no. plausible deniability. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just plausible yeah. deniability. Don't ask, but don't see, tell you might us. get caught. There might be that little thing that leads you to get caught. You know, I got a purse the, the, once. The, I got a purse once, and the yeah, card was in it. Yeah, that see, that's it. But if you're going to re-gift, you're not even going to take the time to comb through it to make sure there's a card in it. I mean, yeah. there, 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 there I think there's some taboo attached yeah. to it. I mean, I think everybody's done it on no. a certain account. No. But I, I think no. if you know no. the other person yeah. would like it, yes, I don't think exactly. I, I have a problem when some people have a closet full of gifts that they have received for the intent of re-gifting. Yeah. That I think is a little. So a quick turnaround for you is okay. Yeah. <laughs> 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 the thing I always re-gift are the wine bags you get, like when people give you a champagne or wine yeah, or something, they give it to you in a I nice bag. Booze. Right. I, I take the booze out and I put my own bottle back into that bag but, but and then for, give that away. The, on that point, if somebody if somebody gave you a fantastic bottle of wine, yeah. but you had one and you wanted to give it to a friend, wine you tell is a little them, different. Wine, yeah, wine, I don't know. The rules on wine, I think, may be a little different. No disclosure on one. Yeah. Yeah. Finally, okay, how long do relatives stay for the holiday? Never. Um, three Whoa! Days. Three days. No, yeah. three days I think is fine. And then they, it's like back. You, you mean like three days after <laughs> Christmas? Like they, they no, get three, three nights days total. total. Three nights three total. total. <laughs> and then you start charging. <laughs> how do you, how do you encourage them? How do you encourage them to get out though after after three nights? What do you like? What's that that key sort of phrase that says you know? I'm thinking maybe we just you work that out prior, right? Yeah. You know, change the law. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I, mean, I can stay as long as you want. It, as again, it want. depends on who it is. Right. Well, well over the sure. holidays is tough. I think yeah. over the holidays, you know, especially if they come a long way. But I think I think you have to respect that after a couple of days, the family has to get back to some their business and sort of life resumes. I've always found that if you just say, hey, everybody, let's go for a drive to the airport. It tends <laughs> 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 to work as well. Yeah. So, Once again, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> I told you it was going to ruin the Christmas. Yeah. 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 Merry Christmas. Don't walk into traffic. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Thank, you. Thank you. Thanks, you guys. Thank you.